Welcome back. It's now 4:47. Elizabeth is enjoying a nice day off, and we're enjoying a pretty nice morning outside. Yeah, it's not too bad. It's a little bit cooler than what we saw yesterday morning. But if you remember yesterday morning, it was very mild out there. So even though it's a little bit cooler, still not too bad to take. Let's take a look at the temperature: 51 degrees currently. Calm winds out there, and the winds will be much lighter as we move throughout the afternoon hours now that that storm system is finally starting to depart. Temperatures around the state, that cold front doing its job. We have cooled down by a few degrees across much of the state. 26 degrees right now in Alamosa, 32 in Taos, 45 in Los Alamos, 42 in Santa Fe. Down to the south, we're sitting in the 50s and 60s here. We're at 59 in Alamogordo, 60 degrees in TRC. 60. Also for Carlsbad, Las Cruces is one of the warm spots in the state. They're at 64. We are seeing more sunshine as the sun comes up this morning across the state now that that storm is departing. We do have the chance just of a couple of light, uh, light spot showers over the eastern part of the state throughout the afternoon hours, but those chances are very slim. I think we'll see mostly sunny skies for much of the state throughout the daytime hours. Taking a look at the big picture, this whole mess now starting to depart the state. We did drop in a backdoor cold front through the late afternoon hours yesterday and overnight, and that has cooled down quite a bit of the state through this morning. That front is going to continue to push down through the south, and will be cooling down for the afternoon highs in the eastern part of the state as well. So the eastern part of the state will be one of those areas to cool down the most. They're going to cool down by about 10 or 15 degrees through this afternoon. And we do have that chance of a couple of spot storms in the east for this afternoon. Otherwise, mostly sunny skies, especially as you move into the central and western parts of the state. Temperature drop here only by about 5 degrees or so. So it's still going to be a nice warm day to end your week. And as we move into the upcoming weekend, lots of good news here. We're looking at mostly sunny skies. Temperatures will start to warm right back up. And we will be seeing less wind for the upcoming weekend as well. So it's going to be one of those picture-perfect weekends, a perfect weekend to try to get out and about and do any outdoor, outdoor activities that you may have planned because this is definitely the weekend to do it. Taking a look at your forecast for southern Colorado today, temperatures here will top out in the mid-60s with mostly sunny skies. It will be a very comfortable day out there, and we do start to warm up even in Durango where highs will make it to the low 70s for Saturday, mid to upper 70s as you move into Sunday and early next Next week, and we stay in the 70s throughout much of the upcoming work week. Taking a look at the northwest, temperatures here in the 70s, 68 for Dulce with mostly sunny skies. We will stay mostly sunny over the weekend with light winds and temperatures in the lower 80s for Farmington. And as we start next week, we'll continue with temperatures in the 80s, eventually dropping back into the mid 70s for the middle of the week. Over the southwest, temperatures here into the 70s, even managing to reach 80 degrees and dimming, 83 for Lordsburg with mostly sunny skies and again. And less wind toward this afternoon, and we will see little wind over the weekend as well as temperatures make a run for 80 degrees by the end of the weekend. And we hover right around 80 degrees as we start the work week, and then a few more clouds for the middle of next week. Over the southeast, temperatures here into the 70s, even managing to reach 80 degrees for Carlsbad. We'll be a little bit cooler over the Sacramento Mountains, 64 for Ruidoso, 58 for Cloudcrop. With mostly sunny skies, we're back into the 80s in Roswell for the weekend, and then approaching 90 degrees as we start next week with mostly sunny skies. Over the northeast, temperatures here in the 60s and 70s, a little bit cooler in Capulene, where we'll hit a high of 58 degrees. Isolated showers and storms, not out of the question, but I think most of us will stay dry throughout the afternoon hours, mostly sunny through the weekend with temperatures in the 70s. We approach the 80 degree mark as we start next week, but we will see a few more clouds. Over the northern mountains, temperatures here in the 50s for Red River and Angel Fire, in the 60s and 70s elsewhere with more sunshine today, mostly sunny skies through the weekend with temperatures in the mid 70s, and we continue with temperatures in the mid 70s as we start next week with a mix of sun and clouds. Over the East Mountains, temperatures in the 60s and 70s with less wind around, less wind for the metro as well as temperatures top out in the mid 70s, and we warm right back up into the weekend near 80 for tomorrow. Up to 81 for Sunday with mostly sunny skies and very little wind over the weekend, and we stay right around the 80 degree mark as we start next week. It was interesting. Yesterday afternoon, I was driving home from the market, and I saw mm -hmm. lightning for like the first time in yeah. so long around Albuquerque. Yeah, we did get one of those very quick storms yesterday, and then we cleared out very nicely. Yeah, I think there were like two or three drops of rain, and that was it. It was over with. Yep, that's weather in New Mexico. All right, we'll see you in a little bit, John. Thanks.